Come take a look at this video of what's being investigated as a possible hate crime at a downtown mosque. It happened in between evening prayers, and Kate Chapel reports it's left many shaken up during the holiest month of the year, Ramadan. This is not going to deter us from anything. Frustrated but unwavering in his faith, Imad Masroor says he's disappointed but not surprised by vandalism at his Chicago mosque. I mean, this is not the first time this has happened to me. Like I'm from Louisville, and um, a couple years back, we um, at the mosque I used to go to, um, it was vandalized with spray paint. The attack happened Sunday night at the downtown Islamic Center and was caught on surveillance video. It shows a man acting belligerently, according to mosque staff. He kicks, then smashes the front door glass with an object before running off. This is an intimidating act. It's intended to be intimidating for people that are coming to worship and prayer. A security guard at the front door tells NBC5 the man harassed women and shouted anti-Muslim threats. The mosque was busier than usual at night due to communal evening prayers during the holy month of Ramadan. Islamic groups are now calling on police and federal authorities to investigate the vandalism as a hate crime. For this to happen right at this time of peace and meditation further exacerbates the horror that this was. Chicago's Council on American Islamic Relations tracks reports of anti-Muslim incidents and says there was a 178 percent increase in complaints over the last three months of 2023, the start of the Israel-Hamas war. That's totally unacceptable, and we do need a stronger response by our government to rein in this kind of hate that is affecting our society overall. Chicago police now confirm they are investigating the incident as a possible hate crime. So far, no one is in custody. CARE is encouraging Moss to increase security and ensure cameras are working properly. Kate Chappell, NBC5 News. Our thanks to Kate.